included. Hi everyone, this is Karthik from IT Learn. All right, so very short video. We are coming up with a new training uh, batch for JPACT, the 10th batch, and uh, that is going to be on the 27th of August. But before we get there, watch this video. If any of these make sense to your team. I've written down a few statements that I typically hear and I get emails from my students everywhere globally and this is the crux of the problem that they face. Things like they've learned manual testing but automation has become hard. They've got some QA experience but they're looking for automation in all jobs. Um, you have maybe a gap for a few extended years. You do not know much about automation frameworks or how to build them. Coding has been something scary for you for a long period of time and obviously maybe you have no experience or projects on automation. So if any of these make sense team watch it what we are going to do with this program. So primarily team job placement and certified training is one of the big initiatives that we launch at IT learn. Our corporation is Workasa. We are a software test automation company. That is what we focus on software test automation. Um, IT Learn has been a flagship uh, service on training that we've been doing for many, many years. Anyot is a test automation framework and a product that we built in the last three years. So a lot to talk about them, a lot of depth on how we've built them and so on. Um, but I would like you to kind of explore what we do. Now talking about the two webinars that are going to significantly change the way you will perform are um, on the upcoming live webinars on itland.com. So if you go to this page, you have all the ongoing current live webinars. At ITLN, obviously you have access to all the other courses that we have as part of one membership. So you do not at ITLN pay any longer for one course at a time. We believe that anyone in software testing or automation needs to have a holistic idea. So we want to give you access to everything that we do at one membership. Um, in the upcoming webinars team, there are a couple of them that I really want you to take a look. The current ongoing one week free JPAC training. We've done three sessions in it and you'll find the links to that playlist out here. Uh, it's just been updated so you'd find it there. Re click here and register team. This is your registration for that one week webinar. We finished three sessions, two more sessions to go. You would know a lot about how to prepare yourself how to create your own portfolio of your projects and your resume. So a lot of a progress has been done on that and a couple of things that I kind of wanted to show you. So we were talking about each and everything on how to go about building a resume. Um, we were talking about how we can segment users depending on your total years of experience, uh, your skill set, where you are. Then we want to put up a plan of how you need to learn what projects you need and how you go about doing. So this is a detailed program team. It will guide you at a um, long level in terms of um, automation. How do you go from manual to automation? Once you're done with this one week webinar that is ongoing, we will then get into our main training program. That is a six week JPAC training starting from the 27th August. It's going to be at 6.30 p.m. Pacific. That's 9.30 p.m. Eastern and 7 a.m. IST. Uh, what is it that this training will have team in these six weeks Monday to Friday we would sit down every day and go through these hands on training on these topics. Now the primary difference for JPAC members and the regular members will come in terms of your projects and project interviews at each phase. We will kick start with manual to automation for those of you who are not very comfortable with automation have no a big idea on to it. This is a great start. We will look at how we progress on these. Some of these are uh, very, very critical for us to know in current market. What are these and how do we work on them? The second uh, chapter in it is about getting towards automation engineer. What is the tools that you require? So you require a bunch of tools to be able to go about building frameworks team. We will go step by step on each of them. I've been doing this for the last 11 years team in terms of training people and enabling them and I know for a fact that this is going to um, um, be a nightmare for a lot of people if you look at it wrongly. If you don't 
learn it in the right way team it can never register in yet so please remember that when you're focusing on this program i will guide you i will take you from the code which is one line all the way to about a few hundred lines that will generate the next is sj team while i'm talking about things like python robot framework and all that the basic concept is how do we do ci cd a continuous integration delivery and be part of the build process for a product or a project in IT. So that would be our software development engineer in test kind of a um, training that will go in third phase. The fourth one is certifications team. Once you've kind of gone through these, I want you to be our product certified. Eniot as a product is extremely powerful on what it can do. And when you have such a uh, certification, it says that yes, I know how to test using any art. I don't know coding, but I can run automation tests. Yes, I can build automation framework similar to any art and deploy it for an end customer. Or I could be someone who's more technical and has deeper knowledge of an SDET. Uh, these certifications become value team, and that is what we will address. So, as an organization, our whole goal and objective is to try and look at your QA career holistically. Um, trainings in terms of what we do, everything will be hosted on our itlearn.com website. All members can uh, sign in, log in, and look at this content. So team, I look forward to you on these webinars. So please do join in, check us out for a few days and see how this will take you. So at least two sessions, three sessions, I would keep them as free demos for you. So for anyone new joining, I think you should give it a shot. Uh, great, that's it from my side. I thought I'll do a short video, a little longer, but I'll see you in the live trainings. Thanks, everyone. Bye.